The Cranes Are Flying is a 1957 Soviet film about the Second World War. So basically the story is about Veronica and Boris. They're in a relationship and Boris is enlisted and he goes off to war. And then the rest of the film plays out as like a psychological journey for Veronica as she settles in with Boris's family. Boris's cousin Mark, he ends up hitting on her and she's trying to stay faithful to Boris because she knows he's going to be back. And then there's a whole other bunch of uh, sequences and events that happen. The main actress in the film, not sure how to say her name, Tatiana Samudlova, Samudlova. Anyway, she carries the film. She's fantastic in the lead role. You really feel for her character and you really get into her mind and the psychological complexities that she's facing. That also helps to be made possible by the fantastic cinematography and the lighting. Uh, the cinematography, there's just such fluid camera movement within the shots and the lighting just really complements that. Uh, a lot of close-up shots with Veronica. Uh, it almost plays out sometimes like a Hitchcockian thriller. Although the film is adapted from a play, there's really nothing theatrical about the film itself. You really feel the heartbreak, the tragedy and the loss that Veronica endures. And to me, I thought it was a well put together war romance film. So with that, I'm going to give it 4 out of 5 stars. Leave a comment. Let us know if you've seen The Cranes Are Flying. It's definitely one of those films that has gone under the radar, uh, but definitely worth checking out. And I'll uh, see you next time. This is James signing off from the Home Video Channel.